So first, of course, we have our gloves in here, so everything is clean. We have a lot of calabaza, you see? We're gonna feed a lot of people with this. So first, we remove the seed. This is the thing that we need to remove, the one in the middle. See it? Then we throw it. Oh la la! See the seeds? You can eat the seeds. Pagwalana Bhaji. Do not try this at home, guys. This is the hardest part. The hard ouch. The hardest part is to peel off. So I guess this is the safest way, guys, for me. Because I don't know how to peel off. Oh, bucket so brahma kapal. Makapal mukha kalabasa. So when you are doing this, you feel like you are artista. You are like doing curves. You are like arting. Not Shobi's artista, the other artista. You see? Para construction worker ka. It's really hard. And I don't know how many hours it will take me to peel off all. That's why I'm starting early night. And tomorrow will be the cooking. Tonight is just the preparations. Kalabasa kala. Chef Ako wanna be. So I'm gonna do all the other calabasas. Imagine how long it will take me. So I'm preparing now the calabasa. As you see, I'm cutting it. Here are vegetables. We have eggplants. Here are tomatoes. We have ampalaya. This is a big pot, you see? It's a big, very big rice cooker. So let's compare it. This is my normal rice cooker. And this is the giant pot in here. The big rice cooker. You see, a lot of tomatoes, a lot of ampalaya in here. So guys, as you can see, this is my outfit. See? So that we are all clean in here. I'm using gloves, then face mask, then also the bonnet in here. So, we're gonna start cutting now. Let's go. So we are now doing the garlic in here, guys. Peel it off. You see how much garlic I have in here? A lot of garlic. Sobra marami. I still have more in here. So I'm not yet done cutting the garlic, then I'll transfer it to the container before we cry with the onion. So it takes dedication and patience. The mountain of garlic in here. Oh la la. I'm so sure Filipinos will love it. Our kababayan, we're gonna love this. Kasi hindi kuripot style. Look at this garlic. So, I made this DIY guys. Hindi sa carbonara ito. Pero, kasi takot ako sa sibuyas. I'm scared I'm gonna cut sibuyas now. So I made DIY. You see? DIY face shield. So guys, I'm ready now with my anti-onion face mask. This is DIY. It's not available in the market because it's made out of garbage. I used <laughs> a lot of garbage to make this mask. Recycle. So our ingredients are in here. This is like 20 kilos of beef guys. Then we have calabasa in here, a lot of calabasa. We have vegetables. They are in order, all our vegetables in here. The kamatis is down because it's the last one. Then we have our sibuyas and garlic. Look how much I have in here. Very big marame. We'll be using one whole bottle of bagoo because the taste comes from this one in here. So I'm outdoors because the kawa is so big, it doesn't fit inside. So let's add our cooking oil. So this is our cooking oil in here. We're gonna heat it up. So we're gonna wait for the oil to get hot. Then we're gonna add our onion, garlic, and then gisa gisa. So guys, this is my own version. I will not gisa the kamatis yet because I want it to stay whole. So I'm gonna put it last. I'll be 
putting first the onion, garlic, then of course gisa, then also the beef. Then we're gonna cook the beef good first before we add the other stuff, the other vegetables. I'm waiting now for the oil. It's kind of taking long to get hot. <laughs> Look guys how big my pot is. Oh la la. So big. So let's add the sibuyas. Look at this. So let's mix the sibuyas first. Oh la la, look at this. Now let's add the garlic in here. A lot of garlic we have. So this is gonna be enough to feed a lot of people, full of nutrients. Let's add the beef. Ay, look at this. This video is not sponsored by the bago. We're gonna add it all, so we don't use too much preservatives in here. All the flavor in here will come from this bago. See, no more bago in here. Finished oil. Look at this. So we're gonna be able to feed hundreds of people with this salsero. See? Beef, ampalaya, talong, all kinds of vegetables and beef are in here. Mix it with the bago. He's gonna add some salt. It's a lot of food. So I'm preparing the rice in here. Before I add the vegetables, let's give them extra rice each kasi hindi kuripot style ito. We are gonna give them extra rice so that they feel full. This is not merienda, hindi merienda ito. To make these homeless people feel full, at least for today. Whatever we have, we're gonna give. So let's add the ulam in here. See? They have a lot of ulam, hindi kuripot style. Look at this. A lot of ulam and a lot of rice. With patience and dedication, you'll be able to accomplish the mission. Let's add more, more and more. Look at this Yemenin. This is Yemenin food. Let's add more. We're gonna feed hundreds of people today. All these people out on the streets, these guards, security guards, or other people who have worked during the lockdown. For these homeless people who don't have food to eat, we're gonna be able to feed them. See, the gula is so fresh. Also the meat. If only you can taste this, guys. 
so delicious. Oh la la, look at this. The vegetable fan. But it's still delicious. Look how much wood they have. Some people told me, how can you cook at your house and then you will not have gas? What if you run out of gas and there will not be delivery? I told them, it's okay. I can manage. The most important thing is we are able to help people during these difficult times. Whew. Boss, pakai.